swap on did it take to swap out the engines? Hang around to the end of the video and you'll get the answer. My new boat was originally equipped with this 1998 Yanmar 3GM30. The motor was not running right and had excessive smoke when it did run. The previous mechanic told us the problem was a bad high pressure fuel pump and injectors. This manifold is showing its age. The original motor mounts from the factory were modified to fit the engine beds. These pictures represent the general condition of the engine, rusty and in need of some love. Looking at the transmission, it is a common place to add grounding wires for the boat's electrical system. One last look at the engine before it is taken out of the boat and the new engine is installed. This is everything it takes to complete an engine swap in a remote location. Newly crafted engine mounts. They use this come along on the boom supported with a halyard to get the engine on and off the boat and below deck. The old engine getting ready to be removed. Little video showing the back of the motor coming out. All the hardware mounted to support the engine and its systems. Baby motor coming out of Chris's boat. Dead. A new baby motor, old baby motor coming out of the boat. Nice. Little motor coming to the boat. Brand new little Yanmar running in boat. Let's see it. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button below. It really helps to grow my channel. Also, comment and let me know what kind of engine you have in your boat. Is it a new one? And tune in next week. We're going to be crossing the Okeechobee waterway to Key West. Almost 350 miles with a new boat and a new engine. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss an episode.